Hey guys, welcome to my new video. In this video, I'm gonna show how to create this animation with using After Effects. Let's get started. So guys, welcome back. And first of all, let's go to Shape Layers, hold this icon and choose Rendered Rectangle Tool. And let's create one rectangle like this. In Clization Tool, let's enable Title Action Save. And let's open Rectangle 1, Rectangle Path 1, change redness for a little bit smooth. Let's click this icon, change size a little bit like this, and go to color. Let's choose color black. Click OK. Let's change name, main, object. And right now, let's go to anchor point, and let's move the anchor point down. Also, we can use animation comes as three anchor point mover. Let's click this icon for move the down anchor point and Clization tool. So let's create first animation keyframes. Press S, open scale and click this icon and change scale zero. And create scale keyframe. Go to 10 keyframes. For a shortcut, you can press hold shift page down in keyboard and change scale 110. Let's see. Okay, go to 10 keyframes again, change 95. Again, 10 keyframes, change 105. Again, 10 keyframes, 98. And last keyframe, 100. Select keyframes and make it easy or click F9. Let's see. Okay, that's good. In this time, let's go to shape layers, hold this icon and choose ellipse and let's hold shift, make one ellipse. Clization tool and go to fill color, choose color red. Click OK and change name left. So in this time, let's move to down and move to right this layer. Press P, create new passing keyframe. Go to 10 keyframes and move up. Let's see. Move up like this. And let's zoom in here. Go to 10 keyframes. Move it down. Again, go to 3 keyframes. For go to frame by frame keyframes, you can press just page down keyboard. 1, 2, 3. And move it up. Let's move it down a little bit. Go to 3 keyframes. 1, 2, 3. Move it down. Again, 1, 2, 3. Move it up. Again, 1, 2, 3. Move it down like this. So, select two frames, make it easy. And we have a lot of two frames for create balance animation. Let's select work area and preview animation. In this time, let's go to back and hold shift, press S, open scale. Click this icon and create scale two frame, change scale like this. And go to next two frame. Let's change scale 110. And this. 92 and go to here change again this 92 and this 105 and go to next few frame change this 102 and this 98 and next few frame 100 and this 100 and make it few frames easy Okay, that's good. Select this layer left, Control D for duplicate, and change name right. And move to right, let's press P, select this position two frames, go to here, and move to right, and let's move it up. And create new null object, and let's move to here, move to anchor point center. And select this right, let's link to null. Select null, press S, change scale. Okay, and let's move to here. And this, select position two frames and move to right. Let's see. Okay, pretty good. So let's delete null object and select these two layers and close settings. And let's see timing. Go to first second, select these two layers and move to left. Let's see. 
and move to behind of main layer move to left lady beat for take perfect timing nice and let's go to back select this layer right and cut cut more nice so select these right and left layers we can change color to black and in this time let's go to shape layers let's create pen tool and make one layer like this Clization tool and let's move to anchor point to left and press S click this icon and change scale 0 let's move to right and create scale keyframe and go to 10 keyframe change scale 110 and this scale 95 and go to 10 keyframes change 95 and this 105 again 10 keyframe change 102 and this 98 and last few frame 100 and this 100 and make it few frames easy nice and let's move to left for dynamic animation move to left more and let's cut first few frames okay so in this time let's select the shape layer one change name main two and create new null object holds control double click pen behind icon for move to anchor point center clicization tool and go to align let's go to window and we can enable align here click this and this icon select these layers link to null object select null let's first move to center and after animations press p create new passing q frame and go to here and move to left and let's create new solid layer add name light and click ok go to fs presses search effect fill and select fill use for light solid layer and change color white click ok and press t change opacity and go to pen tool and let's create mask like this and move to up like this and this so let's clicization tool and open mask mask one and for realistic change mask feather for smooth light okay and move to behind of main to layer also link to null object let's see okay and in this time select this light and let's animate two frames or mask open inside and go to here let's create mask path and select this mask feature for easy control these points and go to back let's change points like this go to back again change points again like this and go to back move the inside again go to back let's make points like this let's see okay select two frames and make it easy select work area okay and in this time select two frames let's make for speed animation select two frames hold alt move to left okay we can delete some two frames let's select this and delete and move to left these two frames okay and let's go to back and hold shift press t and create opacity two frame and move to right change opacity zero and make it easy 
Okay. And right now we can add text here. Let's, for example, go to text and write live. Clization tool and go to color, choose color red, click OK and move to here. Change font size and press T, change opacity 0. And here let's create opacity keyframe, go to next keyframes, change opacity 100. And let's link to null object and make it easy. Okay, let's see. Nice. Select this null, press U, select Q frames, make it easy, go to graph editor and make it smooth graphs. And back to Q frames. Select this light, press U, select Q frames, move to left for perfect timing. And select text, Q frames, move to here. Nice. So guys, thank you for watching my video and don't forget to subscribe to the channel, like video, leave comments and have a good day. Good luck.